IV sedation, you're big on that. You even teach other dentists IV sedation. Who's a candidate? You know, any patient that doesn't like the dentist, anyone who's anxious, anyone who's had a bad experience in the past, those are my typical patient. What I like to do, I send them home with two small pills. I say, take these one hour before you see me, before you ever walk into the dental office. Most people, when they walk in the dental office, the anxiety really heightens. So before they've had any dental procedure, you give them a pill like the night before? Before they leave their home. Okay. Before they leave their home, you have a companion with you, someone that can drive you, a girlfriend, boyfriend, a spouse, significant other. You take the two pills, it's very safe. This is the medication that is used for people that have insomnia. It starts to make you sleepy, not as aware. Okay. They walk into the office just fine. We know they're a little bit sedated. We bring them in, we take their blood pressure, their pulse rate, their respiratory. Then we tip them back in the chair. I start the IV. I train other dentists how to do it. I like to do it myself. I give the patient the appropriate amount for them. Everyone is individual. I have control over it when I do IV sedation. They're comfortable, but they respond to verbal commands. If I say open or close, they do that. I call them that night after the procedure. How was it? I don't remember anything. It was wonderful. I have no anxiety, no memory of the procedure. I had dinner and I'm not in any pain. That's the typical response. Now for the busy person, because you say you can do like six months or a year worth of dentistry, like a, like a woman, like you have six kids, but if you have a lot of children, it's hard to go back and forth to the dentist. So you say you can do multiple treatments with sedation. What do you mean by that? When people are busy, let's say they're a career person, right? And it's hard to take a day off from work. You're gonna take that day off. I can do several appointments of dentistry in one sitting. What I tell the patients is, when I have all my instruments out, I can go more quickly. I also, when I do sedation, I only have that one patient. I have no other patients that I am treating right at that time. Uh, so I'm exclusively theirs, just doing the procedures. I can go more quickly. I've been in dentistry a long time, I'm more efficient. And so I can do an entire year's worth of dentistry in one visit. And they can be comfortably sedated during the thing, during the whole procedure. To them, it feels like, 10 minutes. Is that I right? say, I remember being at home, and then I remember being at home. And I don't remember anything in between. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a wonderful way to do dentistry.